Okay, to start, let's break this equation up into the instance where it would be um, positive or negative, since we don't know which one it was before the absolute value signs. So we'll rewrite it without them. We'll have 1 half x plus 10 equals 1 half x minus 6, or 1 half x plus 10 equals negative 1 half x plus 6. Okay, let's start on the right side first. We can add 1 half x to both sides, and that will give us 1 x plus 10 equals 6. And then we can subtract 10 from both sides, and that will give us x equals negative 4. Okay, so now let's look at the left side over here. Now the first thing we're probably going to want to do is subtract 1 half x from both sides, so let's do that. But, as you can see, it cancels out on both sides, so we no longer have an x term to solve for, and we're left with 10 equals negative 6. That statement is not true, because obviously 10 is not equal to negative 6. So because of that, that is not a solution. We only have one solution for this problem, and it is x equals negative 4.